What's going on, buddy? Welcome back to the channel now. Tuba Crypto here. Time to talk bonk. We covered this yesterday and expected a pretty solid move. We actually got nearly a 12% move on bonk. So is there more to come or is it all about the next big thing? Well, we're going to break down in this video for you as well as taking a look at what is coming for bonk. You're definitely going to want to see this one. But before that, make sure you subscribe to the channel. We bring you the latest and greatest every single day in cryptocurrency and smash a like on this video if you are bullish on bonk. With that being said, let's take a look at the overall cryptocurrency market right now because we're looking pretty solid going into Tuesday here in the UK. Bitcoin hovering around 42.7, got a nice move, 3.5% on the day and a 1.6 trillion dollar market cap once again now when we come down the list you see solana up four and a half percent that is being driven by these new era of meme coins coming out on the Solana blockchain and a lot of movement into the Solana ecosystem. Once again, we've been talking about it on this channel since it was $8 to buy because we knew it was going to be big and it is exactly playing out as we thought. Now you can see Bonk there at the 54th highest ranked cryptocurrency at $1.257 billion market cap and the volume down about 20%, not a surprise as the market did cool yesterday. However, we are in, I think, for a very interesting 24 to 48 hours in the cryptocurrency market. We are seeing more and more news about ETFs, revisions on ETFs, and it would not surprise me if we don't see something very soon. So what has Bonk been up to? Why do I think there is a move coming? Well, you start to look at the narrative that Bonk's starting to push out. So part of their 12 days of Bonkmas, they have now started to move into gaming. You might be thinking, hold on a minute, too bit. What are you talking about? But there is two big moves. Magic Eden, you can now earn Bonk tokens through playing this game. It says, grab yourself a mixed mob, Gen Zero mask, and start playing the game Pay with Bonk for your Mixmac Gen X and check the Bonk in a recent Bonkmas game port developments and again earning Bonk tokens through the game. Moreover, Moonboy doing exactly the same. It says Moonboy's teamed up this holiday season to bring you the fun way to claim Bonk. And I guess this is the point. We already know that cryptocurrency games are going to be big. Bonk shifting the narrative, moving into the gaming industry. So it is there for when the run comes. So we're already in the mobile phones that are sold out, by the way. Some selling this for high as $5,000. Absolutely crazy. And then they move into GameFi, which we already know it's going to be a big deal. Now, what is interesting when you talk about Bonk is ultimately what happened. Bonk's price pumped harder around Coinbase listing than any other cryptocurrency this year. This for me shows you what's behind Bonk. About 600,000 holders currently, which says that Coinbase listed Solana's adopted Dogcoin in the middle of its momentum rally, but the crypto exchange effect will likely wear off quickly. Here is the point though. Bonk is one of the probably only meme coins that we've seen in the last probably two or three years that Coinbase has lifted. A lot of coins have threatened or have certainly said they're going to. Not many have actually delivered on it, but we do know But as part of that Coinbase listing, we saw a massive rally up on the part of that $900 million by mid-December was ultimately what we saw with Bonk. And it says Coinbase listings generally happen in three stages, roadmap, confirmation of support, and then fully fed trade. Bonk and the other crypto exchanges tanked up to 27% after five hours after the roadmap announced, during which time Bitcoin remained flat. So we do know that Bonk ultimately is decoupled. It says there, Bitcoin, uh, excuse me, Bonk rallied up to 50% in the meme coins and more than doubled in 18 hours after it hit Coinbase. That just shows you the effect that it has. And more importantly, here's the thing. It is still listed on Coinbase. It's still there. It's still part of their innovation section, but it is listed on Coinbase. And for me, that is a pretty big deal. Now, you might be thinking, all right, too, but you haven't really explained why you think that we're going to see some more. Well, this is, for me, the reason. We saw this in the 2021 bull run. Ultimately, Google searches. Now, you might be thinking Google doesn't really mean anything, but this is new money. This is people trying to understand what the cryptocurrency is. People who are already in the space, you, I, we kind of know what Solana is. We know what Bitcoin is. We don't need to Google what they are. This is new money. This is people that have seen Bonk. They've seen, you know, kind of other cryptocurrency meme coins, all big blue chips, Bitcoin and everything else. Obviously, there's a discussion right now, $30 trillion coming into the market. Well, this is important because Google increases 250% over the past two months talking about Solana. That's why we're seeing a sentiment run on Solana. That's why we're seeing Bonk going crazy as people are looking to see what it is. What does that mean? Well, it means it sets us up for a very interesting bull market when it eventually gets here because new people were already starting to research what that looks like. They may 
even be starting to buy and that's why we've seen Solana move. We already had those FTX release the dates in which they sold theirs and the market pumped straight through it. So very interesting. We'll keep you updated on all of this, but certainly Solana is picking momentum up very, very quickly. And that can only be a good thing, not only just for Bonk, but also for some of the other coins. If you're interested in those, drop a comment. We can cover those. We've got Jupiter coming up. And if that goes like Jito, that could be absolutely insane. So what's going on with the price right now? Well, there was that pump yesterday that we talked about on the channel over 13 percent just under actually on a nice little move yesterday now the market's just coming into a new day you can see bitcoins hovering around flat 42.6 bonk around 1.3 down snack on the other hand if you want to see that stick around because we're going to be producing a video on snack very soon but 1.3 now what does it look like we are above the volume price index which is this green line coming through here which is a good news sentiment now we've got to push up we're probably looking around that 250 range for a break above potentially then start to move to this higher support line that we have up here at the 3-1 level and again bonk we'll see what we do have is the oscillator down here looking to push back up above this center line which could give us some bullish momentum i think it all depends what happens in the next four hour candle depending on the rest of the cryptocurrency market but my view everything that is aligning for another big push with bonk however though let me know in the comments down below what do you think do you think bonk is setting up for another run or do you think the train has left the station i'm always interested to know your views and once again thank you so much for all the support on the video you guys commenting liking the video subscribing to the channel it truly does mean a lot and i am internally grateful for you guys so don't forget to do it on your way out and i'm going to see you all in the next video Bye bye